I am very happy to meet every one of you for the first time. Mm, January 7, 9.30 and just remember the exact day where I was there. Where I, was, I knew I was a cancer patient and the very first time I saw my dad heartbroken and he cried. That time I never knew how he, how he felt. No, he had so much of pressure and he, he couldn't do anything and he was just sitting there for a long time you know, don't know what to do, what's the next step where do I take my son, where to this thing so, the, so he lastly decided to take me to India for past one year I was there and uh, taking treatment in which didn't show a much result of getting better. So he had a he spent so much over there but still you know his results. So later on we came to Sri Lanka and we um, did treatment in a private hospital for I mean, six months. Even even I did two surgeries, still no improvement. It's the same I was how I am. So at last the doctor told it's best if you go to Maragam Hospital where that uh, where we can give you the right treatment how we want to. <coughs> so as the first day and I went to hospital I just saw I couldn't stay there for the first day. I just called my dad, I told him I can't stay, please take me. The reason I told because I saw the children suffering, they are crying, parents, how they are in everything. When I was in the private hospitals, I never had a contact with other patients or what they are suffering or their pain, nothing else. But in this, when I was in Margama, I saw each and every one suffer, you know, everything. And I just ask them, you know, don't you do like this, you know, go here to private hospital, take a scan, a like PET scan. And they said, no, they, some people doesn't know what PET scan is, some people they say they, they can't afford. Recently, when I was just in the CT scan too, it's not that clear, you know, and you don't need to lie. The CT scanner, which is it's very old, because I have like five times I have even I have been there into the scan, and uh, so it shows how old it is. It's no, you have to go to a next step. You have to change it. So when I and my father once he told there's no PET scanner in Markama, I just told I told him you go ahead. Because with your contacts, we, you can do it. The reason, because one person approves, other, the, that one guy will help you to, will say the other one, and he will get, that will change. And you all are the chains. You are the, the fight cancer team. You are the major, it's the role of this. And everyone says that I am the hero. <laughs> no little. <laughs> But actually, the main hero is my father, because more than that, because he spent sleepless nights thinking about it and he always discussed this about me. Everything went very well, alhamdulillah. <laughs>